There he is. That's a good one. Oh, that's a bruiser, dude. Oh my god. Con. What's up guys, welcome back to my video. So today is August 13, 2020. The guys to see here on the jetty, finally. My GoPro on. And uh, we're gonna be trying to catch some tide today. So decided to come out here uh, on some light tackle. So got my Akuma Pixar as always. Uh, on the star rod, 15 pound braid, 30 pound floor. We're gonna be fishing with half ounce to a quarter ounce bottom sleeper jigs. And we'll see what we can do. So we got a bunch of Asian crabs that I trapped last night. And uh, yeah, we're just gonna be chopping these guys up right here. Throw them on small, small jigs, and uh, hopefully catch some tog. So not even looking to keep anything. Just some catch and release fun, hopefully. And uh, yeah, we'll see what happens, guys. GoPro's on. Hopefully catch some fish, and uh, should be a good day. All right, guys, dropping down. Half ounce bottom sweeper, half an Asian crab. See what we can do. Alright, in the rock. The hit. Little tog. First one of the day. Nice little six incher put up a nice fight on the little light rod. Can't imagine what a 15 incher would do. Oh, there he goes. Seven incher, nothing big. On the half ounce bottom sleeper, man. Missing so many fish just because they're hitting it so quickly, but I'm not gonna complain. There we go, see ya. Back down, Let's see if we can get another one. So much fun on the light tackle, I can't imagine a real, a real bruiser. Oh, there we go, another bite already. Oh, this one. Another 10 inch or so. Getting bigger, five, 10, seven. Oh. So much fun. Going through these crabs like crazy, man. Oh my God. Pitch back out there. There he is. That's a good one. Bruiser, dude. Oh my god. Shoot. Oh. He frayed me up bad. <laughs> That's a nice one. There we go. He measures out to. Oh, he's a keeper for sure. Ah, not 13 and a half. Sweet. 
half ounce bottom sleeper, there's 13 and a half. Or... Yeah, that was a nice tog. Let's uh, let's see if we can get get a bigger one out of there. I mean, that guy put up a stellar fight on this. Let's just check where he frayed the line and cut that off and get back out there. Literally getting a bite every 10 seconds, but all so small. I mean, I can't even, I can't even try to set the hook on. Definitely a bunch of fish here, but not a lot of keeper size ones, it seems. Just little nibbles, not really big, big hits. I mean, it's just ridiculous how much bait I'm losing. So here's our like probably 30th Asian crab we're going through. Caught 156 last night, and we're probably gonna get through all those in the next day or two. Ooh, hoo, hoo. Oh man. There he is. <laughs> that is the tiniest tog I've ever seen. Ooh. That's what's down there stealing your bait. Tiny, tiny, a little tog, three, four inches. Oh God, I didn't mean to throw that away. But I think it's like the fourth one so far. I'm probably gonna move a little bit, just cause it seems like I've caught all the big ones here. I'm just getting those little tiny bites. But I'll move down to that point right there. See if I can do anything different. I'm just finish up these crabs that I'm working on. Fish there and then we'll call it. crabs and ripping up these togs. <laughs> oh my god. Missed them. And that's all the crabs we have left. Small little Asian crab right here is what we're putting on. Going for that big tog. We're gonna move down the tip right there. Look for a bigger fish. And uh, yeah, then we'll be heading out. All right, made out to the tip. There goes all our crabs. <laughs> That's my fault. All right, here we go. Lucky cast at the end. Wow, that water's cold. All right, guys, that's gonna be a wrap for today on the tog rounds. Um, we ended up pulling up, I think, five tog, so not not a bad day at all. Went through about three dozen, four dozen crabs. So um, yeah, that's pretty encouraging. With the, amount, with the amount of bites that we got, the sheer amount of life that I saw down there, we felt water was clear. Definitely triggers and some cheapies could be around. But uh, all in the half ounce bottle sleeper, and notice we did not lose this. For my first time ever tog fishing that I did not lose any tackle or anything. So cross my fingers, that is absolutely awesome. And when I go fishing in AC, I lose probably, I don't know, 10 to 20 lures, 10 to 20 jigs, I mean. But uh, yeah, encouraging day today. Back out here tomorrow for revenge on the tog rounds. Not gonna be doing part one, part two, just two separate videos. Tomorrow my goal is to catch a keeper. And uh, yeah. Thanks for watching guys, hope you enjoyed this video. See you guys in the next one. Peace out.